Hi, I'm Dr. Leslie Tay, and this is my wife. Hello, I'm Lisa, and Gongxi, Gongxi. Uh, Chinese New Year over already. How come you Gongxi, Gongxi? I'm congratulating Food Republic for winning Brand of the Year at the World Branding Awards for 2020 and 2021. Wow, that's quite an achievement. In fact, they're the first food court chain in the world to be given this prestigious award. Wow, I must admit that uh, Food Republic does a really good job at creating thematic and cosy dining spaces. But you know, la, I mean, food court food is uh, Lee Sin, fishbowl noodles, they got Tai Hong, Hokkien Mee. What else is new? Yes, they have all these, but on top of that, they also have veteran and second generation hawkers. You know, people like Chef Shen, Pig Stomach, Chicken Soup. They have the Blanco Court, Hainanese Beef Noodles. And they also have Haja Maimuna, Nasi Padang. Wow, I didn't know that. Yeah. I think we should just check them out. Mm -hmm. Yeah, let's go. Okay, I'm here with Chef Sham. Chef, why do you want to start fish more pig stomach chicken? Actually, what is it? This is fish maw pig stomach chicken. So he made this uh, soup. Basically, it's for collagen. They use lao mu ji and they boil it over 20 over hours. Mm. Wow, very good soup. This soup is impressive. I, I didn't expect to find this in a food court, nah, really. I was a little skeptical because I'm not really into all these uh, inerts. But then this really. Uh, it really is. Really uh, good. It's yeah. the texture. All the collagen, the smoothness of the soup. Yeah. Let's try the pork This crusters. is also collagen. Mm. Ooh. Wow, really, that's a kick. I must admit that it's really very wow. vinegary or very sour. No, this is good. I like this. But it's, it's got enough sweetness to kind of counter it. Lah. I think it's important to note this. He, he tweaks the food to suit the local taste because he knows what Singaporeans want. Oh. So if you're looking for pig frother with black vinegar or if your wife is undergoing maternity and you have to cook for her you don't know where to buy right <laughs> come here and buy this is this is very good to celebrate their win if you buy this 880 mm -hmm. you get this eight dollar pig frother vinegar free so let's move on to the capital bar tommy how is it actually quite good no the sauce has got enough vinegar in it. The chilli is not overly spicy, but it's very pung. And the noodles are done perfectly. It's, it's very, very nice and cute without that uh, pea, too strong a pea flavour. And what I have here is the signature one. The signature one has like your slices of braised bark, and then you also got like your fried wonton. And of course, people who like liver. Keep this video handy on your smartphone. If you come down before the end of March, you just show this video to this bachong mee store, you get this free of charge. Oh, you mean you don't even need to buy anything? Just show your video. Just show the video and you can get this for free. All right, are you going to give Sergeant Chicken a try? But I must say the rice is done quite nicely. It's got a nice sweet um, flavour at the back of the throat, which is very nice. The roast chicken is good. The white chicken? The white chicken, frankly, I think is lacking that gelatin oh. layer. I recall that uh, Scott's Picnic beef noodles is here, right? Yeah, they are here. Uh -huh. Unfortunately, I hear that they are retiring soon. So mm. we won't be able to eat their beef noodles much ah. longer. But not to worry, there's still a very good Hainanese beef noodle. Uh -huh. It's called Blanco Cod Hainanese Beef Noodles at Food Republic Parkway Parade. Okay, let's go check them out. Mike Lowe of Blanco Cod Beef Noodles. Hi. <laughs> Can you tell me a little bit more about the history of Blanco Cod Beef Noodles? Okay, so Blanco Cod Beef Noodles actually started from my kuma, which is my aunt. So she actually started at the street of Hainanese. But then after that, when the government uh, actually moved them into hawker, uh, hawker centres, mm. 
So she's actually moved into Blanco Court. So that's where we actually started. Can you tell me what's the secret of Blanco Court this winter? We all want to know, right? We really stick to our traditions. Nothing has really changed since my Kuma time. We really stick really to the recipe, including the time, how long the broth is being cooked uh -huh. and everything. Even to the herbs and spices, which we have our own blend of herbs and spices. So, you know, that's actually our main thing that makes it special. Yeah. We also emphasize more on quality. Okay. So, the types of meat that we use, like, for example, our soro. Yeah. Like, you know, we use uh, prime, prime cuts like shank, which is uh, actually commonly used in Taiwanese beef noodles. Then our beef balls are also tendon balls, so it's not just normal beef balls. I really like your sauce as well. You know, what's so special about your sauce? Okay, to make a very good, like, pot of sauce, right? Your soup has to be very good, which we really have faith in our soup. And then after that, we have another special blend of spices. It's an upgraded version of our soup spice. We have such a wonderful dish in Hainanese cuisine, which a bit long lost already. So I want to bring back that flavor. So uh, are you Hainanese? I am. I am. Bakongo. Ba 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 I think that's the only Hainanese you can speak, is it? Yeah, <laughs> I kind of flamed by a lot of uh, Hainanese already. But at least you kept the Hainanese tradition of the beef noodle. I think that is important, right? Yeah. I really can't wait to try your food. So hopefully it's good. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I, I'm sure you all enjoy it. See what I got? I wonder how many of our viewers out there remember Blanco Cod beef noodles. Where if you can't, you can come here and refresh your mind. Oh, look at that. This is good. Give the broth a try. Good. That is good, good stuff. That is uh, collagen again. Mm. I like collagen. Because it's got the texture of fat, but it's not fat. Aha! Uh -huh. I must say that the beef ball is not a ball. It looks like a sausage that has been cut on both sides. <laughs> Dead giveaway made by machine. Not, not, not handmade. The bounciness is not bad. Yeah. Except that if you drop this ball onto the thing, I don't know which way it will bounce. I think we have to try the dry. Oh, look at that nice gravy. Yeah. You know what Mike told me? What? He said that actually, because of the feedback that you gave him oh, like okay. years ago. Years ago when I met him, yeah. When you met him and you said that his gravy is not dark enough. Then he said ever since then, he changed the gravy to be darker. Okay, good boy. <laughs> when I last met him, yeah. he was just taking over. Uh, so a lot of things needed improvement. Yeah, but now it's much better. What is the Blanco Corn offering? You can get basically this one for the price of this. So all you need to do is to show the video, yeah. right? And then you can rock up to Blanco Court Beef Noodles and yeah. say, that, okay, I want to have the superior beef noodle. Then you show them the video, right? Then you'll be able to get this for the price of this. And here we are at Sambawang Claypot Rice, but we're not in Sambawang. We're somewhere in Parkway Parade. This is Don and Doris, the uh, owners Hi. of uh, Sambawang Claypot Rice. Tell us a little bit about your Sambawang Claypot Rice history. I picked up this skill during the 80s, uh, my teenage years, uh, because my family used to sell claypot rice. And uh, over the years, we have been cooking for my friends and uh, relatives. Many of them encourage us to open a shop. Okay, I know, I know. Because they feel a bit pious to come to your house and eat all the time, right? If they want to eat your clay pot rice. Food Republic is a very well-known brand and they've worked very hard over the years to preserve, to bring forward very good food to unique uh, people, to gather everyone together. And they, they really work very hard to bring forward Singapore heritage foods. And they're also very selective in tenants as well. So we thought, why not just come aboard? We are other food courts that sell clay pot rice. What makes yours so special? Raw. The rice is raw. From we scratch. cook from scratch in the clay pot. Yeah. At the same time, our chicken is so fresh. Moyang Sao Dot Finish Premium, Lap Chiong. Everything premium. Everything is premium. So I can't wait to uh, taste the clay pot rice again. It's been a few years. Yes, so, yes. Uh, we okay. really welcome you back. We're going to go and try the rice, okay? Remember we had them before in Sembawang, so now yes. they are here. Let's give it a try. One, two, three. I can smell the Chinese wine. Mm -hmm. Probably from the Dok Chong also. Yeah. And they have a special right now, right? I mean, at the moment together as part of the Food Republic brand of the year celebration promotion. Yeah. Yeah. What is Food Republic giving away? Free San Lao Mi Fen with a small clay pot rice. So when you order the small one, you get this one free? Yeah. Yeah. Can we try that? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> San Lo Mi Fen. Some people like to call it Chao Ta Bi Hun. Chao Ta Bi Hun. Fried Bi Hun is one of those things that is very comforting, right? Mm. 
when they manage to cook it until the stock is all absorbed into the bihun, mm. and then you you contrast it with the crispy bit at the side, I think this is a very very comfort food. Ah, uh, wait! Don't eat so much because we got one more place to go. One more place, ah? Yeah. Wow. Okay. We're gonna go and eat this Michelin Big Goman nasi padang. Oh. I'm here with Maria of Hajai Mamuna. She's one of the owners of this establishment. So nice to meet you. Nice to meet you too. <laughs> so Hajai Mamuna is uh, whose name is it? It's my grandmother's name. Yeah, so my mom actually is uh, the founder of Haja Maimuna Restaurant. Of course, along with the help of my grandmother. Basically, Haja Maimuna Restaurant is uh, a dedication to my grandmother. But I also hear that some of the ingredients you all specially get it from the kampung in Indonesia, is that right? Yes, yes. Some of the uh, items are like our pucuk pakis, but that one is seasonal. So that one, we have to get it from Indonesia specifically. And what was, would you say is the specialty? What makes Hajai Mamuna so special? Our signature dish will be our rendang, our escargo, our siput sedut, then our tahu telur. Oh, okay. I'm definitely going to try some of these dishes later on. So our third stop today, we're finally here at uh, Food Republic City Square Mall. I really love the Peranakan facade which I'm told that is basically to pay tribute to all the Peranakan sort of facades, uh, houses that you see around this area. Can we yes, go this first? is the uh, <laughs> very special dish, right, for them. Oh, here we go, ah. Huh? Oh, Ooh. wow, okay, there we go. Oh, look at that. I really like the kicap mani, see it's mm. just the right amount of spice mm. and it's sweet, it's very nice. It's a good contrast to all the curry and all the very lemak. The other specialty they have here is this, um, they call it escargot. But uh, in Malay, it's called uh, siput sudut. The leg is, is a bit tough, so you might have to spit out the leg. Mm. Oh, it's very nice. Yeah, mm. it's a nice texture, right? So I'm sure all of you want to know, by now you know, every food court has got a special, right? So what's the special for Haja Maimuna? Please tell them. Very simple. If you buy one of this chicken set, you get one for free, one for one. And they also have a Michelin Big Coman as well, in testament to yeah. the quality of the food. Mm. Yeah. I must say it's very good. It dispels my presumption that the Food Republic food court is only about their chicken rice, their standard sort of thing. Few of them mm. are really just very artisan yeah. style stalls run by the owners, That's right. you know, that we showcase for you all today. But the next time you're thinking of a place to eat, maybe you should just check Food Republic out. Please remember to uh, come and take advantage of all these uh, promotions that we have right now in celebration of the branding win for Food Republic and happy eating!